What's going on guys? I'm back with another video. Today, I'm not opening up any boxes, no hauls, no car show pickups, no packages, no nothing. I'm going to be explaining what my next goal slash milestone slash, I don't even know what to call it, but the next thing that I'm going to be going for, next com set completion that I'm going to be going for in the hobby for non-sports trading cards. Now, a couple months ago, I had posted a video of me wanting to go for the Young Gun set for Hockey Series 1, Series 2, and Extended. And honestly, that was probably a very stupid decision to me. That was a younger version of me in the hobby and was very ambitious and it was very just a very bad idea. Let's be honest with you. Now, when looking at the Young Guns, you know, there's thousands of them. And over long periods of time, how many people are going to remember 98.7% of the names on those Young Guns? Seriously, you're not going to remember half those young guns that even existed. That they, Most of them played one game in the NHL, maybe. 98.3% of them won't even make it to the Stanley Cup final. Nobody will make the Hall of Fame. You know what I mean? Unless you're, you're talking the Matthews, the McDavid's, the young, uh, the, the, the Ovechkin's, the Crosby's. Those ones are going to have, you know, kind of value, but not the value that I'm looking for. So I'm going to scrap that. I completely sold off all the young guns that I owned because worthless to me. I didn't really enjoy collecting them. I, you know, I don't know. But got rid of them. We are starting with something fresh and I think very, very fun. Very interesting. I don't think many people are trying to do this in today's world. And, you know, I think it'll be fun. Now, in front of me, I have Game of Thrones full bleed autos. All of the full bleed autos that I own. Now, you're thinking... Why Why do you have all these full bleed autos? Well, over the last couple of weeks, all the shorts that I've been posting, I've been posting them recently, more recently than earlier on. But over the last couple of weeks, I've been posting, you know, my pickups of eBay and a good amount of them have been full bleed Game of Thrones autos. So what I'm going to be trying to do is getting every single full bleed auto ever made for Game of Thrones. Now, you're probably saying to yourself, that, that has to be a lot of autographs. It's actually not. There aren't many Game of Thrones sets in the world. I believe there's only maybe 15, 67 in that range of different Game of Thrones sets. And within each set, there's maybe only 15 to 20 full bleed autos that are unique to that set. So it's not, you're probably looking at about 300, maybe 325 different autographs that I'd want to collect. Now, that's not a lot compared to the Young Guns. And it's a lot more unique than going for the Young Guns. You know what I mean? How many people can say that they have full sets of the full bleed autos from Game of Thrones, say season two, season one? There's not a lot of people that say that. And I think that's very unique. And especially for me on the channel, I open up a lot of Game of Thrones because it's my favorite TV show of all time. So why not collect something that I'm going to enjoy rather than forcing myself to, you know, collect hockey cards that I don't even know the players, don't even like the teams. You know what I mean? It's not, it's not fun for me. This is fun, and I hope you guys are going to be able to enjoy maybe me updating every so often of what cards I have, you know, the pickups that I get, cards that I find on eBay. You know what I mean? I can go through the set and, and, and look at Kapodrick, one of my favorite characters on the show. I don't know who that is, but you know what I mean? I'm going to go back and watch the show, and then it'll be, it'll be more fun. But we've got a Roos Bolton. That's a sick autograph. We've got Mace Tyrell, one of the, Ty the Tyrell's grandfather. That's a, that's a sick card. Jojen Reed. And another thing I like about these cards is that... A lot of the characters, so there's some, especially for this one, right? You have Jojen Reed who played a pretty sizable role in Game of Thrones, but he also had a pretty big role in the Maze Runner movies. Those are movies that I like watching. I enjoy watching, you know, this character, right? Her, Indira, what, what show? Wasn't she in another show? No, no, no. It was it was this girl, Septa Unella, right? A lot of people would look at this card and say, oh, yeah, that's just a, a person in Game of Thrones. But actually, it's not. If you guys watch Netflix, Sex Education, this is Jackson's mom. This is Jackson's mom in the show. Her name is Hannah Waddingham, right? That's Jackson. If you've watched Sex Education, that's her. That's his mom. That's sick to me. That's very, very fun, very unique. And yeah, and also, I just like the look of these cards. They're super clean autographs, all on card. And I, I don't know. Now, like I said, there's 300... There's probably around 325, 350 different autographs, and there are some pretty big cards. 
especially this card right here. Hopefully I can find it. If not, it's going to look really stupid. But the Emilia Clark Daenerys Targaryen has a full bleed auto from, I want to say it's season one or two. That's a four figure card, at least, right? And I believe she has another full bleed auto in another set. But, you know, Tyrion Lannister has full bleed autos. Arya Stark has full bleed autos. Sansa, I want to say Rob Stark has a full bleed auto. Uh, his wife has a full bleed auto. You have, did I say Cersei, Jamie? You know what I mean? There's some big autograph cards in here, and they're just not that easy to find. You know what I mean? There's there's a rarity factor to it. And that's what I like about this so much is that it's unique. It's, you know, I want to be able to go to a show and bring my Game of Thrones collection, and it would be the only one in the room. It'll be the only collection in the room. Maybe one other collection, but you know what I mean? I think that, that this is going to be a fun little project that I'm going to be going for, and I want to take you guys along, and hopefully over the next couple weeks start adding to this more and more and more. So, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned to the next video. Let's hope we keep adding to this collection. Bye.